August 17th, it was a day for the record books across Texas, a blistering 109 degrees in Dallas. Some temperature gauges contend it was even hotter than that. Power plants worked overtime to generate electricity. Ultimately, the lights and the AC stayed on, the power grid held, but all was not well. Behind the scenes in the control center at ERCOT outside of Austin, some say there was a real fear that the grid might fail. An outright forecast that when the sun went down, Texans' demand for energy would exceed the supply. That's when state officials called upon a nondescript solar farm out in Scurry, Texas to help save the day. Enel North America's Lilly Solar and Battery Storage Plant, nearly half a million solar panels soaking up the summer sun and feeding it to a hungry electric power grid. Very simply, this is how the operation works. Solar energy comes into the panels. The panels send it over to the inverter, about 100 yards that way. The inverter turns it into electricity which sends it over here to the substation which then pushes it out to the grid and that's what cools your home but the real magic the grid saving muscle is housed in those rail car looking containers 24 of them on site a row of 30 cabinets and inside each of them 17 racks of batteries ready to dispatch electricity in the event of an emergency just like what happened around 8 p.m. on Thursday night, eight days ago. And that's when ERCOT gave Enel North America the call. So they called upon um, batteries and, and really asked, you know, can you deliver everything you've got right now? Help us prevent a situation in which, you know, folks' air conditioning might go turn off. Enel North America's Madeline Gould Lachlan says the Lilly battery plant joined with its six other storage plants across the state to help prevent a grid emergency. By delivering around 320 megawatt hours of electricity to the ERCOT grid, enough electricity to power about 25,000 homes. But just based on, you know, what I was tracking, we were within um, it looked like a thousand megawatts of reserves. Um, so that's a situation that no grid operator um, wants to find itself. And if you look at the figures of what Enel and other battery providers were able to deliver, um, it certainly looks like batteries were able to make up that gap and help prevent a blackout. No blackouts, no loss of power. And until now, no real mention of that Lilly solar farm just doing its job out in Scurry, Texas. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. And for more refreshing stories about your community, click the subscribe button right over here. You can also download our Spectrum News app to get live news coverage, weather alerts, and more wherever you are. And don't forget to tune in to Channel 55 on DISH and DirecTV for live local reporting every single day. We'll see you then.